And what would you say to the guy that he thinks he's on his computer back home, he thinks he's discerning, he thinks he's crafty and smart, he thinks he knows how to, you know, check if this might be the one of the five percent, let's say, <laughs> that, that's real, that's sincere, and he puts her through all these checks, he thinks he's smart. Uh, what would you say to him? Brian, for guys that are engaged, you know, communicating with a beautiful Ukrainian or Russian woman, what are the telltale signs, like the main telltale signs that you know you're being scammed if blank? Paying for a letter, paying for chat, paying for videoing when, you know, video conferencing. Um, if the woman immediately, after you've just started talking wants a gift, wants you to buy a gift off the website. Oh, buy me flowers, buy me a teddy bear, buy me perfume that is a hundred times marked up what it would be actually in a store here in Ukraine. <laughs> so Brian, let me clarify. Are you saying that if any guy's paying to open a letter, uh, like an email, paying to access a picture, paying for uh, video, that categorically it's a scam, you know that? Oh yeah. Or just chat. Just think of it. A window pops up with a lady's picture on it. Are you really talking to her? But you're paying for every minute you sit there and talk. And what would you say to the guy that he thinks he's on his computer back home, he thinks he's discerning, he thinks he's crafty and smart, he thinks he knows how to, you know, check if this might be the one of the five percent, let's say, <laughs> that, that's real, that's sincere, and he puts her through all these checks, he thinks he's smart. Uh, what would you say to him? No, you, you've fallen for it, hook, line, and sinker. Hook, line, These and sinker. women, <clears throat> most of the agencies. That's not the women, right? No, it's that's the That's the other agencies. thing. It's the agency that's bad, not the girl. No. The girl usually doesn't even know you. She has right? no idea. The agencies mm -hmm. themselves, the translators, you know, they will send them to classes on how to keep you engaged mm -hmm. in a conversation. Hooked, hooked. Exactly. They study NLP even, Neuro Linguistic Pro Programming, brainwashing yep. essentially. You study in the, in the they Secret keep, Service, they keep the FBI. Cool. Yeah. And they yeah. do. They yeah. actually send these girls to school for this. And, and let's not mention that the best scammers or translators are actually men. Mm -hmm. Because men know what men want. What? Right? Exactly. Exactly. So, uh, any other telltale signs that you're being scammed because we want to help guys out there that are being scammed understand so that you guys can uh, cut cut and run run for us run yeah and yeah. if you want to come to ukraine and meet a real woman uh brian is there a lot of lonely single beautiful oh. traditional value women here that are just clawing at men to I'm, find I'm, a good man for I'm, marriage i'm sitting here looking around us and i find it funny because i now i understand why a friend of mine said you must wear blinders like horse <laughs> <laughs> very because distracting as we're very distracting. sitting in the park in exactly. Poltava here. Exactly. So your answer is yes. What? Yes. Hell yes. Are, right? Hell yes. Hell yes. But but the first um, first thing you need to be to do to be successful is get out of fantasy land. Yep. You know, yep. pull that red pill that you swallowed out of your mouth and um, stop looking at the Photoshop pictures. Yeah. 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 You gotta you gotta come here. That's uh, that's job one. Come here, and then get yourself a solid education. Any other uh, tips or red flags? Learn some of the culture. Uh, pay attention. They are very family oriented. Um, if you hear horror stories about, and that's another thing too to know. You know, I didn't even think about that until just now. Um, you will be fed stories to pull at your heartstrings, like we were talking about the classes. They're taught to how to pull you in. The scammers online. If you hear that, oh, this happened to me when I was or my grandmother's in the hospital, or my mother needs this, so just run. Don't, send me money. It, just run. Should they ever send never, money? Never, never, never. When you haven't met her? No. Never, guys. Never, never ever, 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 never, never send money to a girl you haven't met. Period. And I mean, even if you just... met her here, well, you're a lot better off, but still, you have to be discerning even then. I would even say, realistically, even if you've come and met them once, you come back a second time, if things are the same or better, then yes. yes. You, that's kind of traditional. I mean, that's... It is. The men support, if, you're, um, if you see your future with a woman, the woman's expecting you to... But not right to... Not... But not, not too early. It's, no. it's a very tricky subject. Mm -hmm money the money question that's why we're rolling out more and more videos on that uh, where we actually ask Ukrainian women about money and women what they expect from exactly, men exactly. because it is a very really complex subject but yeah don't start supporting her too no, early no. because then you can't discern 
what's what real you? and what's not. Correct, correct. So, I mean, thank you, Brian. You're a gentleman and scholar. On behalf of men worldwide that you've done hundreds of scam checks for, or you said about a hundred, yeah, right? About a hundred. Hundreds of hours helping guys without pay. Uh, we thank you. Thank and you. Karma thank will you return do. to you. <laughs> thank you for what you're doing. I mean, this is this is good education for men. Just drop the egos, guys. Drop, drop the, the egos. egos. Get your ass to Ukraine and make it happen, guys. Yes. You can do it.